days, I'm going to be showing you how to improve your flexibility. Also, go follow my Tornastics Instagram, um, at Tornastics, and I'll link that in the description box below. And also, go subscribe to the Mass Sisters. Um, I'll link that in the description box below as well. It's a channel with me and my friend, and it's I got a lot of challenges on there, and I'll be posting those this week. So let's get started with the video. Uh, I'm going to be showing you just how to improve your flexibility. And for many people, flexibility doesn't come easily. So you really just going to have to work at it and really try to like improve your flexibility on your own. So improving your flexibility is really important if you want to do really good in your splits and just be really flexible for baton, dance, or tumbling, any of your sports. So I'm going to be showing you just a few ways to improve your flexibility and if you just work at these things then you'll have your like really good flexibility in just a few days. So first we're just going to stretch and this can help improve your flexibility as well. So just sit in a V-sit and just go to your leg, the middle, and your other leg. And just hold it for a few seconds. Now just put your legs out in front and try to pull your nose to your knees. Now try to grab your toes. The next stretch is called the butterfly stretch or whatever else you want to call it. So you put your feet together and you're just going to push. This can help stretch your legs and this helps your flexibility. Another good stretch is your splits. But before doing your splits, please stretch really well and so you don't hurt yourself. If you already can't do your splits, it's okay. Just hold what you have. And if you hold that for five minutes every day, you can get down your splits, which can help your leg flexibility as well. So I would just hold my splits, make sure you stretch. Just hold each split for five minutes a day. Flexibility is by doing back bends, back walkovers, front walkovers, anything that moves the back and lets it stretch. If you don't already have your back bend standing up, you can just push up from the ground like this. And just hold your back bend. But if you can do it standing up, that's a great way as well. help with flexibility is doing hill stretches and scorpions. So just hold on to a wall if you have to, but if you don't have to, just work on pulling your leg and just standing here. Another great way to like improve your flexibility is to stretch your back. And a great way to stretch your back is to just go lay on something and just have your back arched and just sit like that for a few minutes. So if you have like a yoga ball or anything like that, that's a great way. But a couch, everyone has a couch. So, or a bed or anything. So like a couch, a bed, an ottoman, anything like that, a chair. You can just sit on it and just sit like this and just let your back be stretched. This can help if you don't already have your back bend um, or your back walk or anything. To help stretch your back is a great way. Okay. So I'm sorry that's such a short video today, but I'm going to be filming some more videos today. So make sure to catch those on Tuesdays for Tumbling Tuesday. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. For more ideas for just twirling or tumbling videos, comment down below and I will be sure to take your request and do some video with it. Don't forget to go follow my Twirlnastics Instagram for more fun and more Twirlnastics fun at Twirlnastics. I'll link that in the description box below. 
thanks for watching guys thank you for the support don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video thanks for watching guys bye